In this tutorial, we are going to use concurrently package to run backend and frontend of our project in one single terminal. Currently, we have two terminal, one for backend. We need to run npm run dev in backend folder, and we need to create another terminal for frontend and run npm run dev in the frontend folder to be able to run the project like this. But what we're gonna do is to install concurrently package as a depend as a dev dependency using this code. Open a new terminal and while you are in the root of your project, run npm install save dependency concurrently save dev concurrently next step is putting dot git ignore in the root of project just go to the backend folder copy dot git ignore and go to the root and control v paste it right here by having this in the version control you just have package.json it has concurrently in the dev dependency and dot git ignore like this. We can get rid of this one too. Just right click and add to git ignore. And there we are. We only have dot git ignore with this code, package.json with this code, and this lesson. Next step is in the package.json. Open it and add a new command in the script section it is dev for dev we are going to use concurrently so type con currently and here i'm going to put two commands to put commands we need to use backward slash double quote backward slash double code and put command here the command is npm run dev but we are going to run it in the backend folder so put dash dash prefix backend put an space copy this command and paste it to duplicate this line this time change prefix to frontend so what we did here is to run two commands npm run dev in backend and in frontend concurrently save the code open terminal and make sure that you do not have other terminals just kill terminal for frontend and for backend and you should have only one terminal and here run npm run dev make sure that you are in the root of project the same folder as package.json run npm run dev and press enter awesome here we have the code for frontend the log of terminal for frontend and this one is the log of terminal for backend if I control click on the front end, awesome, I have my project and both back end and front end works. And the thing is, we only have one command to run the project. It's npm run dev in the root of project. So we don't have two separate terminal to run the code in the development mode. Great, that's it about this lesson. Until next lesson, bye-bye.